Hello some viewers how are you all welcome back to another video guys in this video we are going to learn how to interact with radio button so without any further ado let us start the video guys So now, let me create a file here. So under the examples, so I'll create a file. I'll name it as interacting with radio button. Dot. This was the last video which we have seen. Writing my first spec. Dot js. What I'll do? I'll copy this. So I'll put it in interaction. Interacting with radio button. In order to launch a website in Cypress, we'll use cy dot visit. I'll open the website. So there is a simple web sample website. You can open it here. I'll show you. So in this website, we can easily select one of the radio buttons. And radio button functionality is same. We select one. Others are not selected. That is what radio button is. So let me inspect this. So I want to select uh, radio with name. So let us see the inspect element. So it's a paragraph. So inside the paragraph, so I have radio with name. It is a value. I need a proper value. So let me select value as no here. It is it can it is a kind of unique and it will select radio with class. Already radio one is selected. Here. So I want to select radio with class. So now let me copy the URL here. So in order to click that, so we'll use cy dot. I'll use get request. In that get get you can give you the you can give the locator's name. So it will be an input tag as I've shown you here. So this is this is an input tag. Now I have to select a value no. Uh, no file give so input value now. So what I'll do, I'll use a should should what should be dot visible. So it should be visible on screen. So just launching the browser without uh, radio button getting popped up, it, the, the test case will always fail. So I'll be adding should, and I'll also add another should stating. Okay, let me put uh, to the right. Okay. So now code will be properly visible. So I'll write another should. Here I'll declare. Here I'll use not p. You have to use not p check. So now I'll do what? I'll do click. So what it will do? If it is not selected, then click it. So now after that I'll do. I'll use a wait. It is a delay in Cypress. So I'll wait for three seconds for uh, for you guys to observe that it is properly clicked. So let me click on enter. So I'm running a Cypress with the head, uh, headed mode. In this sense, the browser will launch, and all the actions will be performed. Typically, a test runner will open here, and after that, inside that, actions will be executed simultaneously. Actions will be executed simultaneously. Right side browser will be executed. So now, as you can see here, it has launched the test runner. So test runner, what it will do? It will see what are the test cases are present in under the example stack. Now, as you can see on the left hand side, it's loading the test. Right hand side, you see it will uh, launch the total URL of the browser. So, left hand, you can see so it has launched the visit. So, launch the browser. Now, it will click the radio with that. It has no click. Now, it is waiting for three seconds. Now, the browser will close. Now, you can see the here test has now passed. Now, the video file is compressing. I'll put this code in the description. Let me know if you have any doubts. I can use more and more examples here. So as you, as you can see in the down, the specs have now passed. So example interaction with the JS has now passed. So that's it for the video, guys. If you like the video, please click on like. And if you're new here, please click on subscribe. Till then, guys, take care. Have a great day. Bye bye.